And Mars Crusader well in the market. The money continues to come for him. Can Willie Pike have Mars Crusader closer today? Mars Crusader, $6.50. He nearly knocked off Nature Strip in the Everest. Another bound, and he would have made it very interesting. Now we've got Bellucci Babe is being attended to by the farrier. Right, so Bellucci Babe just being replated here behind the barrier, so just a slight hold up for the call up into the gates here for the TJ. So still a few extra moments to place your last minute investments on the race. Well, Nature Strip and Eduardo, they've clashed on nine occasions and Nature Strip holds the record 5-4. Ken Eduardo, level that up today. He loves the heavy tracks. He's outstanding on it. Nature Strip has won two of his three. And when successful last, last year, the going was a heavy eight on this occasion. Nature Strip today has drawn the outside barrier. Eduardo has drawn barrier three. And rule of law, expected to be right up on the speed as they move them in well now. We're moving in here for the TJ. And count the rupee to come up with rule of law, Bellucci Bay, but looks as though the farrier's work is complete there. And Josh Parr jumping back in the saddle. And Nature Strip will be one of the last to move in. So they're getting set well. 2.30 about Nature Strip and Eduardo at $4.80. So we're waiting now on Bellucci Bay with the white coloured cap to move in uh, along with Nature Strip. So Bellucci Bay just being trotted up behind the barriers, having been replated there behind the start. Can Nature Strip claim his special piece of history today? The sprinting king of Australia, beaten in the two lead-ups, but looking for a three-peat here. Last year's Everest winner with regular jockey James McDonald in the saddle. So Bellucci Babe goes in uh, and Nature Strip Moves up now to the outside barrier and they're ready to rumble in this year's TJ Smith Stakes. Stand by. They're ready to run. Racing now. And Eduardo jumped brilliantly from barrier three. Shelby 66 away well. And Nature Strip is rolling forward. So it's on already. Eduardo leads from Nature Strip. The two big wigs running one, two in the early part. Followed by overpass. He's in a handy position together with Powell Laley. Mars Crusader trying to improve on the rails. Deeper out then is Rock and Horse. Followed then by Rule of Law. Shelby 66 drifting back now. Followed by Count the Rupee, Bellucci, Babe and Zoo. Tory is the last one. Nature Strip takes the lead clearly at the 600 metres. He really went steady on Eduardo in second spot and their dominant leaders coming to the turn from over past Paulele and out deep is Rock and Horse. Shelby 66 gets onto his back followed by Mars Crusader taking a rails run. Head of the straight though Nature Strip extends his lead on Eduardo. Two and a half between them and they're well clear from the rest. Nature Strip at the 250 two lengths in front. The eight year old Eduardo's trying his heart out but Nature Strip wants his piece of history today and he's got it. Here's a TJ treble for the Sprint King. Nature Strip goes on to beat Eduardo. Palaley third and wide up Bellucci Bay running fourth just in front of overpass. Then Satori from Shelby 66. A gap back to Rule of Law. Mask Crusader, Rock and Horse and Count de Rupi was last in. He's done it. Making it three straight, joining Chautauqua as the only two to make it three in the TJ Smith Stakes and under James McDonald it dominates. 2.30, New South Wales Super Tab 2.20 on the U-Tab, he's back. Horse is a freak, jockey's a freak. I mean, he summed the race up 